Welcome to Illuminati Silver. We tell you the truth about silver. Today is Friday the 18th of November 2016 and we are commenting upon Janet Yellen's statements reported yesterday. The head of the US Federal Reserve, who has been criticised by Mr Trump, warns Congress on the danger of political interference. America's top central banker Janet Yellen has delivered a defiant message to President-elect Trump by telling US legislators she fully intends to serve out her term until 2018. Ms Yellen has been subject to speculation that she might step down after Mr Trump was openly critical of her during the election campaign. Trump accused her of, quote, being too political and was keeping interest rates low not to help the economy, but to help Democrats retain control of the White House, unquote. But she said she could not see any circumstances in which she could leave her role as chair of the US Federal Reserve early. Ms Yelling told a congressional hearing, quote, I was confirmed by the Senate to a four-year term, which ends at the end of January 2018. It is fully my intention to serve out that term, unquote. She added that there had been, quote, terrible economic outcomes in countries where central banks are subject to political pressure, unquote. Meanwhile, Ms. Yelling signalled that the Fed could raise rates relatively soon as the US economic picture improves. So, what are we to make of this? Well, for the moment, it's a wait and see operation. Some will believe this is the establishment standing up to Trump. Some will believe that it's just a game between the two parties pretending they are at odds when secretly they are in agreement. Some see it merely as political posturing prior to any meetings between them. If this divergence of views isn't genuine, then each of them can exert tremendous power. Yellen can persuade her board to do more or less whatever she likes with interest rates, or even just make a statement or two which could have profound effects on the markets and blame Trump. Equally, Trump could issue threats or warnings which could immediately upset markets and cause the dollar to plummet, forcing up rates, should he so wish. It's currently too early to tell. But one thing is for certain. Whatever these characters do or say, it will have a profound impact on the lives of many tens if not hundreds of millions of people around the world. President-elect Trump's comments now have significance and when sworn into office will have overwhelming influence. This interplay between these two parties will truly reveal to us whether Trump is truly independent or part of the establishment of which many accuse him. Meanwhile, any uncertainty that is created is positive for precious metals. However, having said that, it does appear that we are entering into a higher interest rate environment, and then their prices may indeed take a hit short term. As we produce this video, gold is down some $10 over the past 24 hours, and silver is down 24 cents. We shall, of course, provide our weekly update tomorrow, where we give not only a summary of this last week's activity, but also our forecast for the remainder of November. We hope you have found this video interesting and informative, and if so, please give it a thumb up and share it on Twitter. Also, kindly visit our website at IlluminatiSilver.com, and if you haven't already done so, please subscribe as a free member for regular email updates and offers. Our Facebook page, which is updated daily, can be found at facebook.com forward slash Illuminati Silver. Disclaimer. Illuminati Silver owners come from a background of banking, international wealth management and economics. 
Having now retired from these worlds, we are not qualified to give investment advice. Therefore, this and other productions must not be deemed to be giving such advice and merely represent the personal views of its owners. Mm -hmm.